They're calling it a major milestone. Crews this morning drove the first steel sheet piling into the sand in Mantaloke. This project is designed to uh, withstand a 1% chance storm, a 100 year storm. About four miles of steel sheet pilings will be installed in both Mantaloking and Brick Township's beaches this summer. Each sheet interlocks with the next to create a complete uninterrupted bulkhead underneath the Army Corps sand dunes, which aren't built yet. The steel sheets are 45 feet long and 4.75 feet wide. The primary purpose of this of this building, of this whole effort right now, will be to protect Route 35 and critical infrastructure in the state. It's also here to protect homes and property. The Federal Highway Administration will pick up 80% of the nearly $24 million price tag. The state will cover the rest. The steel pilings will be driven 30 feet below sea level, and crews will replace the sand at the very top of the piling. The Army Corps is expected to begin its beach replenishment project this December or January. Commissioner Martin says less than 400 easements are needed along the coast. The majority are in Ocean County. And the governor's made it clear uh, we're going to be using whatever legal action necessary to get those easements at the end of the day. As for the easements needed in Mantaloking for this steel sheeting project. We took the easements for this project under the Disaster Control Act. Mantaloking's mayor says the project is critical to this beach community, which was devastated by Sandy. There are more than 520 homes in Mantaloking. Officials say every house was damaged by the storm. And now 20% of the housing stock is gone. Who would build without protection, right? That's why we want this project. I think then you will see a lot far more uh, building permit applications after they see that we've protected the beach. Oceanfront homeowner Marilyn D'Alessandro eagerly watched as the pilings arrived in town. I think it's wonderful. When it started coming in the other day, I felt like it was Christmas. It was like the presents under the tree, but we can't open them yet. The project is just as important to Brick Township Mayor John Ducey. We had 8,000 homes that were damaged and uh, $548 million worth of rateables. We're, we're still down about $500 million in rateables. The beaches will remain accessible, except for a 500 square foot area crews will work within. The project is expected to be completed by late October. In Mantaloking, I'm Lauren Wonko and JTV News.